Good morning folks, or good evening, or good afternoon, depending on where in the world you are uh, as you watch this and when you watch this. Welcome to No Niche Nick, uh, where I uh, have a few uh, uploads of videos about all sorts of interesting things. Uh, and I'm going public on uh, showing my journey through YouTube land from zero subscribers to wherever I end up. Uh, so we shall see what happens. Now, uh, my last couple of videos, a couple, well, I think my second video I did, this is video number maybe four, I think, uh, or five. Um, in my second video I did, I did a very rough video around uh, AliExpress and what I love about it. You know, I was thinking uh, last night when I came home from my uh, day job or night job, um, I thought to myself, right, what's the next video going to be? And then, timely, I got through my phone uh, confirmation that uh, a package from AliExpress that I've been waiting for um, has arrived. Now, this particular package, uh, we're going to do an unboxing. It's not really a box, but an unpacking of it, because uh, actually... Because uh, I use AliExpress quite a lot, they've uh, combined three things I bought and put it into a combined uh, package. Uh, this particular one um, has come so fast, it would be probably not even two weeks. And uh, as I said to you previously, the, uh, the last one I arrived, which was the new screen for my uh, motorbike, that took women three months, drove me crazy. Um, also, uh, I've uh, another one of the videos, do check out my playlist and uh, don't forget to subscribe, of course, and like and all that resume jazz. Um, but uh, one of my other uh, videos, uh, I talked about the uh, Wii video, uh, video editing, which I played around with for the last video, which was a million times better than the first two. So um, now I've got that. Hopefully, I'll be able to actually uh, do a few videos and cut and splice and do all that that stuff so um that's really interesting i have to say so anyway welcome again now i still haven't got the microphone for the uh, camera or the um, mobile phone i'm using um so the uh sound is uh not ideal but uh, i will deal with it you know um for now until uh until I find something appropriate. Also, I don't have a lamp here, so what you're seeing is me au naturel with a bit of natural light coming through the front uh, the front windows, uh, my front sliders. So um, not ideal again. However, we'll just deal with it, shall we? Because it's part of the fun. So welcome to my living room, dining room, kitchen, office, and office. Um, all in one, uh, nice and easy care. So uh, yeah, anyway, let's get on with it. So unboxing, now I have to be honest, I've just been to the post office and I picked up the package, right? And I sat down in the car and as I normally do, I ripped it open before I even went anywhere because I wanted to see the quality of the items and what they actually look like. Um, so, and then I started opening it, so you see I've opened it, Thank you. and I thought, oh, this will make a great video for No Niche Nick. So, I stopped opening it, I haven't actually opened the actual packages inside, and I thought, well, I'll wait for now, do a video on it, and uh, it's all the more exciting. The other thing I love about um, online shopping and with AliExpress, because it does take a while, as I said, is that basically um, you kind of forget what you buy occasionally. So depending on how many things you buy, um, I've been waiting on these. But it's kind of like Christmas, right? Because you don't know about the quality of them. You don't know, you know, um, whether they're exactly what you think they're going to be because you look at the photos and look at the measurements. Now, it's very likely today that these actually, there's three items. Um, I'm hoping, the main one I'm hoping is good is, is the mobile phone holder for my motorbike. Um, I've trialed a couple before which were pretty crappy. So this one I'm hoping is gonna be better. Um, I've also, uh, the other one, the second item in here is a shirt, a Motor Guzzi T-shirt. Now I said in a previous uh, video around the fact that I that I dislike immensely, or well, rather I'm not good at choosing the right sizes of clothes, so I've had a couple of misses with that. So we'll see what happens with the shirt. It could be like a tent, or it could in fact be like a wetsuit, so we'll just have to wait and see, or it could be okay. That's the fun of it, isn't it? So, and the third item we're going to unbox or open up is, uh, what is it? Oh, new motorcycle gloves. So as you can see, 
quite a few of my things are heavily weighted, weighted towards a motorbike. That's really what I spend money on, not much else. Um, however, um, it's good fun. So we'll see how we get on. So anyway, without further ado, here's the package. There we go. Came all, uh, you know, with lots of uh, bubble. I've half, wrapped, half ripped it open. So let's do the first one first, shall we? So this... I think looks to be, yes it is, this is my, the, the holder for my oversized uh, phone that I also bought on AliExpress. Now I need some scissors, where are my scissors? Hold on a moment, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, <laughs> obviously. Right, so package number one, which is my new cell phone holder for the motorbike, and it's got a... Uh, a special attachment to it, so I can attach to uh, um, to my handlebars. So we'll see what happens. Now, as I said to you, my phone is pretty big. Ooh, look at this. Not too shabby at all. So it looks sexy, quite tidy. So let's see. Let's cut off the label. It's called Wheel Up. The other thing that's cool about AliExpress, right, is sometimes the descriptions are hilarious because obviously for a lot of the sellers, English English isn't their first language. So it's it's good fun to read the descriptions, uh, which is which is awesome. Right, so label is off. So here we go. Now, as you know, my phone is pretty big. Uh, where did I put it? So I lose everything all the time. Hold on a moment. I'll be right back. Uh, my doogie, my doogie phone, my 5G phone. Now, let's see, how do we get on here? Okay. I've done this well. So, I'm opening this up. I'm really done this okay, well. so inside we have the attachment that goes on the handlebar. That looks pretty straightforward. Very good. Now, it also doubles as a wallet. So, Let's first of all, let's have a look at the actual, uh, where we put the phone. So let's have a look here. Oh, sorry, there we go. So I'm just opening up. They've got, obviously, the, just a bit of cardboard. Ooh, yes, 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 yes. Right. And let's close that up. Oh, that fits beautifully. So, oh, and look, the screen works beautifully too. Okay, so we're good to go. This is for sunshade, so it's when it's on the handlebar like that, because sometimes with phones on your motorbikes, with the sun, they actually, uh, they'll heat, overheat, and they'll close themselves off. So, fits my phone beautifully. Plus, I can move all of my stuff into into it. My, you know, for my um, cards and all that resume jazz. Oh, super happy with that because it also doubles. Obviously, uh, well, kind of doubles as a wallet. So, because you know, as as you know, I've I've. Uh, got my man bag which is a similar size to this so a little bit bigger so yep very very happy with that that is actually honestly it fits like a glove it's amazing so in another video what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you once I've put them on or I might even show you show you putting when I'm putting them on the bike um, although that could be a comedy really because uh, I'm not incredibly good at DIY so with the most simple of explanations, uh, I can usually stuff it up. So I may or may not uh, record that, uh, or I may record it and then cut out, <laughs> cut out some of it. But anyway, we'll see. So that was item number one. And as I said, it only took less than two weeks to get here. Very happy with that, happy with the size. I did actually get the size right. Um, so hey, awesome. Right, so that's the first thing. Now, come back to my package, and let's see, what have we got next? This will be my, this will be the shirt, so, let's have a look here, we can cut it, eh? Right, okay, so obviously, 
I didn't plan this out, the opening up very well, did I? I need like a table and stuff, so, um, or to put the mobile phone down or something. Yeah, anyway, doesn't matter. Right, shirt. Blue, bluish, like the bike. Okay. So, now I'm not... Oh, that's quite big. That's quite big. Right, let's see. I'm not going to take my shirt off. Well, let's have a look. Yeah, that's pretty big. <laughs> I mean, a big size. One size too much. Maybe two sizes. Motor Guzzi. It's the 100th anniversary, you see, at the moment. So, let's have a look. Put it right on top. Yeah, that's gigantic. But, it's actually quite nice. So, oh! Better cut that bit out of the video, didn't I? <laughs> anyway, so. Um, I've just cut that last bit out because uh, when I took the shirt off, my other shirt came off and I, you don't want to see that. So. Uh, anyway, great quality. Size is, is rather large, but actually... That's my issue, not the um, not the seller's issue. So I chose 3XL, but actually I probably should have just gone XL, or large even. Which is not bad, considering. That's another video for you, because actually I've lost a hell of a lot of weight. Um, I, well, I've lost and put on some. So um, I lost 31 kgs, um, which is an awful lot of pounds. Um, I have put about eight or nine of those back on though uh, since our second COVID lockdown. So, shirt, happy with that. Size a bit funny, but generally I'm pretty happy with that. Right, package number three. This will be my gloves. Gloves, gloves, gloves. Now, where. Oh, there we go. I want to, I want to cut the gloves. Right, let's have a look here. So, here we go, nothing like a bit of plastic to be environmentally unfriendly is here. Okay, these I took a bit of a punt with the size as well. I actually would get it right if I paid more attention, but quite often I buy these things at 11.30 at night when I'm just, you know, playing around on the phone. It's fantastic. God, you've got to love technology, haven't you? Hold on, technical. Okay, here we go. So, whoop, more covering. Ooh, they're blue. Blue. Blue for a start. And, right. Okay, here we go. Gloves. Now, the key is, do I fit them? Yes, 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 I do. Yes, I do. Right. Oh. Oh, they're good. That's perfect size. Perfect size. Right. Oh, they're comfortable too. Okay. Right. Motorcycle gloves. New ones. Now, how much did all this cost? Um, I can actually, I can work that out, so hold on. Anyway, motorcycle gloves, comfortable, warm, they look pretty good. We'll soon find out in the rain what they're like. Um, I love the blue, blue's very nice. And imp importantly, these should pop over my leather jacket, which I wear uh, quite well, so that helps with the wind, you know, not going up your arm. Um, so... Those are the gloves. Very happy with those too. Oops. Undo. Okay. Have to go for a ride and try those out soon. Very soon. Can't at the moment. It's got puppy at home. And uh, uh, although the weather's nice out there, you've got to work tonight. So, right. Now, how much 
do you think these three items cost? Now to give you an idea, to give you an idea, basically new gloves here for quality, $100 plus. Um, this, which just finding something specific like that is not easy. There's quite a few for sale cheap ones, right? But you know, good, and this has got the connection for the back on the bike. Um, very happy with that. Uh, they might be, I don't know, for the motorcycle specific branding ones, you know, they're hundreds of dollars. It's ridiculous, really. And t shirts, obviously, t shirts are fairly cheap, you know, but it's branded again, so it's the motor goosey. So let's have a look here. What did I pay for these? Bear with me a moment while I go to my uh, my phone phone. Uh, oops. Just go nine and go like that. Right. So for this, seventeen dollars. Uh, sorry, twenty-two dollars in total. That includes uh, getting it shipped all the way to New Zealand. The shirt, $27 in total, so not that much cheaper if you go down, oh, maybe it is, yeah, so that's all right. And the gloves, $30, really cheap, really cheap, $30 in total, so happy with those. Um, now, in the meantime, I've missed a couple of phone calls, a couple of texts, so I'd better go and uh, check those out, check who's calling me, um, and... Uh, yeah, I probably will might do a follow-up video as well. Um, so that is my, those are my purchases that have just arrived today. I've got the shirt, the phone holder, and the gloves. So I'm still waiting on a couple more things, and one of the videos I am going to do is showing you all the bits and bobs I've actually put on the bike. Um, uh, some things are useful um, and practical, and there's a couple of things that absolutely aren't, but I quite like them. So, um, yeah, very happy all in all. Um, so I hope you're having a great day. I um, hope you're staying safe and uh, be kind out there, and I shall talk to you again. And uh, I'm also, I've applied to be a, um affiliate, I think it is, for AliExpress. Shot off an email this morning. Um, I'm not at the moment, but uh, but I figure that you know I like it. I like shopping there. Um, I like the excitement of getting the getting the parcels. Um, and actually, relatively speaking, for a little old New Zealand, it really is great for um, you know picking up some bargains sometimes. So um, you know, obviously, with that. Uh, referral thing um, I uh, one day soon I'll be able to hopefully put a link down uh, down there somewhere in the description uh, so then if you do click through and you do buy something um, well then you know maybe I'll get two or three cents worth from it um, or not whatever doesn't really matter um, it's just fun this journey so uh, yeah take care and we shall talk again soon